Hi, this is Daniel Daly. I'm the um, founder of the Advancing Noah Movement, Advancing Noah Movement of the Seven Divine Fellowships of Karite, Adamite, Noahite Faith. And this is just uh, a little article on principles of the Rainbow Torah. I define the Rainbow Torah as a passage of scripture from the Tanakh, the Hebrew Bible of Genesis chapter 1 verse 1, the first part of the Bible, to Genesis chapter 11 verse 9, the uh, end of the Tower of Babel incident, which is a history of, um, of uh, creation through to uh, Tower of Babel, Noah's children there. It's um, relevant for all mankind today, not just for people of the Middle East, not just the Hebrew, Ar um, Abrahamic people, but all mankind, because we're all descended from Noah. Now, um, this is an examination of the Rainbow Torah to find out some just basic principles of religious rule which would apply to citizens of mankind universally. These are the, basically the biblical principles if you wanted to know, if you weren't of another religion and you wanted to know what the, the Hebrew Bible taught that uh, in our tradition is applicable to you, you know, to your life, this is what we would teach you is required Genesis 1, 1 to 11, 9 and here of it basic principles, principles of the Rambo Torah. we we'll go through them one at a time. Sabbath. Sabbath observance is not commanded to mankind, but voluntary following God's example seems acceptable universally. Genesis 1 to Genesis 2 verse 4. Modesty. Animals are not a suitable spouse. Genesis 2.20. Marriage between a man and a woman is normal. Genesis 2.24. Wearing clothes is normal, Genesis 3.21. For morality, do not eat the forbidden fruit. It's command still to abstain from it if, if it was available, but theoretically it's still in place, Genesis 2.17. Avoid sinful behavior, Genesis 4.7. Listen to your conscience, the voice of your heart, Genesis 6.5 principles of the family. Keeping genealogies is normal. Genesis chapter 5 and Genesis chapter 10. Procreate. Genesis chapter 9 verse 7. And uh, respect for living things. Do not eat animal blood. Genesis 9 4. Put to death murderers. Genesis 9 5. Principles relating to food. All plants may be eaten. Genesis 1 30. All animals may be eaten. Genesis 9.3 Behaviour standards Getting drunk can lead to embarrassing situations. Genesis 9 verses 20 to 27 Curses and blessings Curses as punishments and blessings as reward are part of the faith. Genesis 9 verses 25 to 27 Humility principles Pillars of Babelite or Tower of Babel pride not based on God's authority are irregular or improper. Genesis chapter 11 verses 1 to 9. Honoring God. Calling on the name of the Lord is normal. Genesis 4 26. And making sacrifices to God is a regular part of faith. Genesis 8 verse 20. Now they're the principles, just, just some of them, there's, there's more. But there's, there's some of the examples of the things which we would argue in the advancing Noah movement are applicable universally to mankind today in this post-flood era of it. Those things, those principles still generally apply to everybody and they should be following those religious rulings. In the remainder of the Tanakh, the Jewish Bible, there are principles and laws and rules pertaining to the people of Israel. The book of Isaiah teaches that Israel is the light to the nations, so we should probably notice the light, and whatever we make of that light, we make of that light. They're a priestly nation unto God, it says. They serve God in that priesthood. So whatever we make of that light example they send, set for us, we make of it. And if, they, if we take any knowledge or ideas in from that, that's our choices. But what is applicable, as far as we're concerned, are the principles of the Rainbow Torah, Genesis 1-1 to Genesis 11-9. 
in uh, our movement, we have our own religious writings in the Rainbow Bible, not the Rainbow Torah, but the Rainbow Bible, which is my own developed theological statements and ideas and writings, etc. They're not binding universally upon mankind. That's my own developed ideas and ideologies and thoughts. But for our movement, they can, if you joined our movement, they would become relevant to your life. But if you're just some regular man, member of mankind, want to know what we teach from mankind universally, just the principles of the Rainbow Torah. Okay, uh, thank you. Daniel Thomas Andrew Daly, Canberra, Australia. Uh, May 6178SC or since creation or May 2015.